Um, well, you know, throughout the whole game, I think there was a lot of fight going on. Uh, maybe um, in the beginning, you know, it was both teams were giving it everything they had, and um, we couldn't seem to be, you know, scoring at the time. But you know, we were moving the ball really well. But I think the second half. Uh, they probably started to give in, you know. So, how much did Samaje play a part in that? Oh, he, you know, Samaje had a great game that day. And um, as much as we were as an offensive line uh, last year, we were um, doing a pretty good job at making holes for him to run through, you know, even after the safety breaking tackles, you know, two or three tackles and um, gaining more yards and um, then. He should have. So, I know you guys have raved about him since really the summer when he first showed up. But did that game show you guys something more about him? Absolutely, absolutely. We saw the fight and um, how much he wanted it, and uh, how much he uh, wanted to do for the team as well. And um, even after the game, uh, an amazing game that he had that day. You know, he, he never he wasn't one to talk a lot or anything. You know, it was just all about the team. And, um, which showed us great, you know, he had a great attitude. Neil, I know it was a couple of years ago, but after you made your first start on the line, did some did anything change for you? Did you see the game differently? You know, guys like Alex did it last weekend. Yeah. Um, um, after my first start, you know, I think after every year, you sort of, as an athlete, you, uh, I don't know if it goes for everybody, it's like a light bulb goes off in your head and, you sort of see the game in another way and uh, a higher level. And uh, it becomes, uh, it flows better. And so you're more confident in what you're doing and um, what steps you need to take to make a block and how you need to um, approach a certain block and stuff like that. So, Is that something you really have to kind of play in a game to learn the guys like Alex and Jamal and obviously Derek inside kind of maybe learn that last weekend? <laughs> You say plan on it? No, it's something you can only learn when you play in a game. Um, light bulb sort of light bulb. He, I mean, I, I think for me, the light bulb thing sort of went off in the summer, um, going into summer camp. But um, I think playing in a game really does uh, show you it's a, you know it's it's different from practicing. You know, you're going against different people, and um, as much film as you watch on whoever it is that you're playing, you still need to uh, be in there to realize um, the difference. You know, so, Neil, have you uh, watched much tape on these guys on West Virginia yet? Uh, yep. Yeah. Um, they're strong statistically, great in the back end. I know they have a good linebacker. How, how are they up front? How do you see the matchup? Um, you know, they have some guys returning um, this year, uh, which, you know, brings experience with them. and. Uh, seeing that we have some younger guys um, on the offensive line, but um, I think with the experience that they have, um, it'll be an advantage and something that we uh, need to take into perspective and consider it. So, does the offensive line as a group, and maybe Bill Bienbo as a coach, even talk about the fact that there's so much t discussion? Your offense is kind of loaded everywhere. The offensive line has struggled. Do you guys mm -hmm. ever? Talk about the fact that uh, you've not gotten respect. Uh, you know, it's it's definitely something we've talked about, but I think as an offensive line, we uh, um, sort of take it personal. You know, try to make it personal and um, try to make those gains and um, do the things that we need to do with whether it's film or in practice, practicing harder, or watching more film, and uh, just learning how to perform more and. Uh, maybe even talking, uh, me and Ty talking to the younger guys and how it um, should look like and, you know, being that example for them, so. How are you feeling physically after uh, some time off? Feeling better, feeling way better. Uh, that, I think that bye week really helped and I'm um, ready to get back to things and start practicing and get ready for this game. Have you seen the difference with Alex and Jamal because of the fact they were able to get that playing time against Tulsa? Yes, yeah. I mean, I think uh, they now sort of realized how much work it takes and um, being um, 
in that front position and the pressure that it takes and uh, what you need to do as uh, when you're when you're actually in there and playing and stuff like that how much you need to focus on technique and uh, you know things like getting low pad and stuff like that so I think it's it's really giving them a perspective and uh, sort of um, how to look at everything now you know getting prepared Thank you.